and we're live. Welcome in everyone. In this video, we'll be going over the Give Cars to Friends glitch. Okay, this is how you receive vehicles from your friends or anybody in the game. All you will need to do is either own a party bus and have it stored in your office garage or get in a friend's party bus. So if you own one, just go to your garage, hop in, and drive it out. Or you can request it, either way. Now if you own Maze Bank West office, you just want to pull your party bus out and drive it back in nice and slowly. Doesn't have to be turtle slow, but you don't want to go too fast because uh, it, it can tend to just bounce around. So you just want to take it in nice easy as if this was it, you just drive it in like so. No big deal, okay? Now for this garage, if you're working out of the Maze Bank Towers, what you're going to want to do is simply drive at this wall by the circle and clip it and it should push you back into the option. Okay, from here you want to choose the garage which it is stored in. Boom. Now you get this screen. Go ahead and click PlayStation button and join Anawak. And then accept all the alerts. Anawak 1P5 for PlayStation 5. That's which what I'm on. You can also set him up in a message chat to get to it a lot easier instead of typing it if you don't have him as a friend. Now here, once you're glitched out, you could fall through the mad, you could be in an invisible bus. Uh, a few different options uh, may happen. Either way, just hop out of the bus or teleport, call you a CEO chopper, anything you want to do to get to your facility. I'm going to teleport, so I'm just going to go up here and find the job I want to teleport to. We're going to click to join it. And then we'll join Anawak one more time. This time we will accept the first alert, decline the second alert. Accept, decline. All right, this will pop us out right at our facility. All right. Now, once you've arrived at your facility, you are still unable to call a mechanic or pull out your weapons or anything like that normally. Alright, so what you want to do is either go inside your own facility, this will unlock the ability to call your mechanic, but you will still be, not be able to run. In order to be able to run, you just want to get a request from any friend's facility, or their MOC, or Avenger, okay? Once you've accepted to go in there, you can just exit, and you will be free to run, pull out your weapons, blow yourself up if necessary, okay? Now, once we get all set up, we're ready to go. I want to exit my facility and I come out here and I like to turn around up on top of this to where I'm not looking at where my vehicles are going to spawn. Now, every facility is different on spawn locations, but it works essentially the same. If you'll stand on top of your facility and look backwards and then request your vehicle, it'll spawn right behind you. What the hell? That's not what I meant to do. There we go. Call the mechanic. Request my free ISSI. Now if you don't have an ISSI or a scramjet, you can have somebody flip you until you do, but it's preferable to have one of these vehicles or a vehicle you're comfortable flipping yourself with. I'll bring it by. I will call out an ISSI. Then I'll have my friend request a vehicle to give to me. And once they're both out on the map, I will turn around. Now, if your friend is just giving your vehicles, he can just stand up here and look back this way. All his vehicles should spawn behind him if you are not staring at where. You just spin your camera, that's all you got to do to, to not look necessarily. But if you're looking back at where the vehicles are going to spawn, they're not going to spawn there. It's going to push them somewhere else, usually much further than you want to go to get them. Okay, so... Let's just give myself a donor. Might as well. Okay. So now we got our car. Our friend's car is spawned in now. Okay. So here's our vehicles. I'm going to take this car in. I'm going to flip myself with this vehicle. Now, jumping points are different from, from all facilities. Um, some facilities you usually jump from an angle because you're on a hill. Um, looking down at the facility. So my facility's up on a hill. I like jumping from the top up here. But the mechanics are all the same. What you're going to want to do, I'll show you here. What you're going to do is you're going to jump, 
push forward on your D-pad to your vehicle is roughly pointing down like that. Pointing. Point pointing? Pointing. <laughs> okay. Really very simple. Now with the scramjet, a lot of times people like to jump, push up on the lefty stack and the stick and right at the same time. So up and right to where they flip like that. Okay. So totally up to you on which vehicle you use. Mechanics are roughly the same. You just want to get your vehicle to where it is at least vertical before you hit the black screen. Okay. So on my facility, I like to jump from right here. It's just the spot. I hit it about 99% of the time. Doesn't work 100, but about 99. So all I'm going to want to do is I'm going to jump. I'm going to push up on my left D stick. Once I hit the black screen, I'm going to let go of the left D stick. Wait about half a second and then click X to accept the alert. Okay. Perfect. From here, you can EWO or hop out of the vehicle and kill yourself. Make sure as to not blow up this vehicle. You need it. You need it to stay on the map until you take in your other vehicle. Okay. So now we're just going to run back up, grab our friend's vehicle, and take it right in. Now, when you hop in the vehicle, you may not have a yellow marker. Not to worry, it will pop up. All you need to do is just wait a second, it'll pop right up, then you're free to drive in. Perfect. It's as easy as that. Once we enter the facility, we will choose a vehicle to cover up and replace. And this vehicle will then be ours. Once you've completed trading, you will need to close your app entirely and restart it to unbrick these vehicles to where you can mod them and put them into any garages which you choose. Okay. Let me just cover up this Windsor. Bada bing. All right. Easy as that, guys. Super simple. I'll be doing trading parties all the time. I'll be here to help. If you have any questions or comments, drop them on down there. If you happen to like this video and found it useful, please put a thumbs up. Peace.